Like today the plan is, well, I'll be staying here for five days. Um, so a lot of hikes to go around here and lots to explore. Um, today I'm gonna try to walk along the river in the valley. I'll go from Lekush to Shanox. Um, I want to explore the towns, find a bit more in the tourist information center. I might try to do a small hike to the glacier, which is 8 kilometers. Right, I'm entering the forest now. We are at 990 meters. It can be a bit cold. But it's around 10 degrees, so later on we'll we'll go up. It's 9 o'clock and then the sun it didn't rise above the mountain yet. Well, it's a high mountain. It's like 400, 4,500 or 800 meters. And obviously we are at 1,000 meters here. Wow. Wow, this is a really wide... Wow! Right, so we've done almost halfway of our walk, no, more than halfway. I can check the delivery. Right. So the delivery, we're gonna try to force myself to come and do it on Thursday. Right. We're on uh, probably the main square of the town. Still trying to find the formation so this formation is on there. Where is it? Oh, obvious. The tourists finally found it. Alright, so now I've got some food, I've got information, so I'm probably gonna get the bus. I'm gonna try to go up to that place as well. So it's 12.36. So it's around yes, round three, four hours with stops, breaks, it's in let's say six hours, so six hours you'll be back. Still daylight, you get the pass. Uh, here. Nice. Nice. We start going up. I need to climb up about 150 meters, so probably I've done 200. So. so I walk this morning from where you got that lake down there. That's where I'm staying. Actually, I haven't checked how much I've been walking. Lot of barriers in this. No telephoric for me today. Ah. Obviously, this is not working. Here's the view. Wow, has a viewpoint up there. I'm gonna go up there. Don't look down. Uh, uh, oh my goodness. Wow. Whoo. Yes. Yes. Glacier. 
I've seen a glacier finally. Well done. So after the break on the first viewpoint for the glacier, now I'm going further up to reach a second point, which will be above the glacier. It's still an hour and a half to go up there. And then it will take me three hours to go down. Ah. Right. So it is two o'clock now. In a small break, I was a very zigzag section that you get quite exposed. So now it's getting a bit flat. What is the time now? So it's 2.30, so by quarter past three from up there and you know had a break of 15 minutes enjoy the view <coughs> change my clothes start coming down it would take me another two hours at least so by six <coughs> so be on this side so I will be getting some <coughs> right so worst case scenario we wait until someone comes up and then we go down under my plan of going up to that chalet which is supposed to be above the glazer I still can see the glazer from here there's two people they helped me I came up to this point just to feel a bit more stuff there I was just probably having a panic attack because uh, when I reached that point and I see how exposed it was but you know it's always when you go up you need to remember if you can go down so now I can go down this way it's fine I'm gonna sit there for a bit, enjoy this view. That on the right side. I'm not gonna even look down that way. Guys, 4.30, we're nearly done on the valley. Just need to get a bus, go back to the hush. I'll get do some grocery and I'll go to the hotel to rest. Just home. Back down to the bus rooms and us to take me to the hush. Le Couche now, I've done some grocery shopping and I am gonna head back to the hotel. I'm back to the hotel. Oh, it's ten past six, been away for ten hours. 